good morning guys good morning good morning rise and shine welcome back to another youtube video <laughs> hey guys i know it's not your usual welcome but you know it's early in the morning well it's not really early right now but when i video this y'all would get what i'm saying anyways guys i'm gonna be showing y'all a morning in my life well this is gonna be a six to eight before my eight to five to show y'all what my morning routine looks like so stick around guys guys this video is being brought to you by groundsy as a first time mom there was lots of stuff that i just did not know and i'm so grateful that i had older folks or more experienced folks in my life to guide me through and something that i had to learn as a first time mom is the whole baby food like purees all of that what month your baby should start getting the baby purees the when you're starting them on solids like guys once you get the groundsy baby food maker it is the one item you'll need to make all your different baby foods i love that this is designed with the four blades and listen guys you don't have to be using several different pots to make your baby food all you do you add your water to it and I have my vegetables here that I'm going to be making a puree and I'm using a mangoes to make a smoothie. Check this out guys. You can use this same machine to blend, to steam. I love the display screen on this food maker and it is an 8 in 1. So you got the steaming, blend, self-clean, sterilized purees, even meat and it also signals when it needs more water this baby food maker is a perfect for all the parents out there that want to be making their baby's food from scratch listen you can do all your meal preps for your little one blend their stuff steam it put in their little containers and have it ready to go guys you look at that i could have it to go in while i was doing other stuff around the house nevi was so excited to try her food smoothie that i made with the mangoes and strawberries this baby food maker can be used through all the different stages of your baby's life you can use it with the four to six month to make the smooth fruit puree for your baby or even if you're making a thicker creamy puree and you can even use it to steam to get the solids that your little one needs so guys I highly recommend this because this four blade blending system it ensures a smooth uniform blending when preparing baby food you want to make sure that your baby is getting all the nutrients that you need and the over-the-counter baby food with all the additives is not really the best for your little one so with the groundsy baby food maker it is designed with a steaming structure to lock in all the nutrients for your little one so you don't have to worry about the loss of nutrients during the cooking process of the baby food because the traditional cooking methods can deplete the vital vitamins and minerals essential for the healthy development of the baby my favorite function is that it has an auto function that steams the vegetable then it blends it and has it ready to go look at that guys the perfect puree for your little one and it also can clean itself guys and when you are dealing with the baby food you have to make sure that the item is sterilized and it does have that function where it will sterilize after it's done the cleaning process and it is ready to go for your next use to prepare your very own baby food now that we've seen how handy the groundsy baby food maker is make sure you click the link down in the description of this video so you can get your very own and a special thanks to groundsy for sending me this item because who y'all if i had this when nevi was a baby this would be saving me so much time all right guys back to the video so you know i'm starting my morning with drinking some water i don't know guys I sincerely apologize. You see the condition of that mirror? Why is my bathroom mirror looking like that? By the time you guys got this video, please know I have cleaned that mirror because I'm just like, I just want to reach through the glass 
through the camera right now and i just wanna wipe it down because how did i not see that it was getting <laughs> but anyways guys i quickly did my usual morning routine which is i do my face wash then i brush my teeth because i have to brush my teeth before i start my day floss do all the stuff guys one thing i'm trying to improve on is my skincare routine now mind you i do have a whole routine set but my problem is that i pick the bumps and that's where I'm struggling, but I'm trying, you know. I'm starting to use a toner, doing all the things. And I've noticed an improvement with my skin, but every time I go through a certain period of the month, that's when I get, like, all the breakouts, and it's just... Intimately. That even before I got here, I was in his presence. And even as I'm here, I am in his all right, so I'm trying to get back into the routine of doing my early morning workout because... One thing I know, if I don't work out in the morning, it ain't gonna happen. So I just like quickly change my clothes. But before I went downstairs, guys, there's just something about that early morning, fresh air, the early morning brightness. And I like to go into one of the rooms and just sit and just you know just enjoy some quiet time before the chaos of the day starts and i'll do my journaling or i'll read a scripture or something you know just enjoy those slow moments first mind you this is not an everyday thing for me to be emptying the laundry guys i don't wash every single day but i did some laundry last night and i was like oh let me get these before they get all crushed because you know when you leave your laundry they tend to get a bit crushed and we're opening up the blinds getting that morning sunlight Guys, let me tell you, I used to think it was impossible working out in the morning, but just start. Just try it one or just try be consistent a week and you'll see. Guys, am I the only one that loves that bright early morning sunshine? Like, it just does something to warm my spirit and to just get me in a happy mood. Like, if I wake up in the morning and it's overcast and it's cloudy, I just feel, eh, I don't want to get up. But then when I wake up and it's like bright and sunny and the sun is rising, it just gives me the best feeling. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I love I love light. Like, you know, that sunrise. So your girl is trying to lose a couple more pounds or just to get in shape a bit. So we're getting that early morning ride because if you don't know by now, I always start my day with a cup of tea because I do not eat breakfast early in the morning. I normally just start my day with some coconut water and I'll do some ginger lemon tea, unsweetened of course, because we're doing no sugar in our tea in the morning. And I like to carry my oats to work. I would normally like cook it from like Sunday and then I'll just share it out in the container and reheat it once i'm ready to eat and i normally eat probably about 9 9 30 but mm, probably closer to 11 really is when i have my first actual meal for the day so at this point now i normally just pack my little lunch kit so i'll take out nevy breakfast bar like a snack for her to have after i pick her up from daycare and I'll carry a little snack for myself to have during the day. So I just basically pack up my lunch bag, lunch kit, whatever you guys want to call it. <laughs> and during that process, I'll also unload the dishwasher. Because I like to leave everything, you know, organized. One thing I'm going to do is I'm going to listen to the weather and I'm going to listen to some news. I cannot believe I'm now at the age where I've actually enjoyed listening to the news. Like, come on. A couple of years ago, I would be so annoyed when my parents used to have news on in the morning or in the night. I would be like, why do they need to sit and watch the news? I bet you that's how my daughter is going to be looking like, oh my gosh, why does my mommy watch the news all the time? But I like to stay updated with all the relevant topics and know what's going on in our day-to-day -day society because we're living in a crazy time <laughs> so of course <laughs> then i want to you know start the shower because i need a nice hot shower to start my morning well i like a hot shower in the night in the morning it doesn't have to be so you know anyways guys this is what my hair now looks like <laughs> <laughs> your girl is bald i did a little color but anyways <laughs> this is the one time y'all probably will see my hair <laughs> 
at this point i realized it was time to wake nevi up so i went to woke baby girl up and i took a quick shower and got herself ready you know what's crazy this morning when i was actually getting her ready i had a bit of like a flashback or like a recollection of a memory and i'm like it is so crazy i don't know how i even remember this but I have a memory of like when I was little like Nevi, probably I was five or six. And I remember my mom having me at the edge of the bed just like this. And she was putting on my white sneakers. Y'all know in Jamaica we wear uniforms. And I literally was remembering, you know, mommy took, my mom, she took so much pride in getting me ready for school. You know, my uniform would be freshly ironed and she'd put in my little ribbons and my clip in my hair and i'm like look at me now doing this to my daughter like i am now a mom with a four-year-old and i'm like this is crazy because i don't know how i even remember those memories you know but so this was one of those mornings where Nevi had a lot of questions for me and she was asking me about god and all the things so i had a quick chat with her all right let me tell you something God is never on vacation, okay? Okay. God is always watching us. I think God just got a baby in his belly. No. He is always watching us. Everywhere we go, even when you think mommy is not seen, God is watching us. Okay? Come here, let me finish speak to you. Come here. So, <clears throat> if you do anything, you got to make sure that you are doing the right thing so that God will be pleased with us, okay? Because we don't want to make God disappointed, okay? Yeah, that wasn't very nice. It's okay, but don't do it again, okay? Alright. Always do what is right. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm still tired. I'm still tired. Yeah, I was taking a and I didn't play. You didn't play? I was playing with your ears. Yeah, you were playing with my ears last night. Yes. So when I go to bed. Yeah. <laughs> and I didn't make a single noise. Yeah, you went to bed on time, so <laughs> good job. <laughs> Why? My brother for Snickety is monster is very So <laughs> if you're wondering where those questions came from that Nevi asked she has such a curious mind guys and one thing i love is that she is so comfortable with asking any questions anything that's on her mind she will voice it and ask and that is just to show you how smart she is because i don't remember what she said oh, oh i just remember so she had said something right and she told me like yeah she went to the bathroom already but i know she didn't go to the bathroom because i was watching her and then she was like oh did god see me and i'm like yeah he sees everything i think i want one of the people's bike but i got like this hoo, ha, hoo, ha. Hoo, ha. Hoo, ha. Hoo, ha. Hoo, ha. When you go to your daddy house, ask your daddy to buy it for you. We're gonna keep this one here. Because if you bring that to your daddy house, then we won't have any here. So when when you go to your daddy, ask him, okay? Uh -huh. Today is work fit. I got this cute top. Anytime I wear this outfit, it kind of reminds me of like a referee or somebody like that. So the top is from Sheen. The pants, 
I think I got this from Ross here. Yeah. And I just have uh, just some regular black sandals. This shoes, I actually bought this off Sheen for Nevi. It's a size smaller, so I'm going to return it. And, uh, and get a bigger size for her. But yeah, I love today's outfit. It's super simple, but cute at the same time. <laughs> Alright guys, let's get to work. Guys, I'm going to tell you something. You see from the day you have a child, just know the days of carrying one bag is over, okay? If it's as good as you want me to see that they can so stop going for me. And then I'm going to go stop doing that. I need somebody to help me open my seat. Hey, mm -hmm. thank you. You're welcome. Alright guys, so I am off to work now. But first, I'm going to drop Nevi off. Yes, I did it. Can I, can I have the music? Okay, give me a second. I like the way this looks. Alright, give me a second. Let me start up the car first. Ew. Alright, guys. That was my... What is that? That was my <coughs> 6 to 8. So, it's time for Where work. Yes, Nevi? Hey, The name of the song is The Wheels on the Bus. Okay. okay, I'm coming. I was about to leave out and then I was like, my hand feel empty because I didn't realize I didn't have all any of my jewelry. So I went back in and I got my jewelry so my hands don't feel empty anymore. Yeah, and Nebby showed him here. Nebby's like, what you said, baby? And Nebby's wearing her son too. <laughs> So I won't be itchy. Yes, baby. Are you my glasses? Do you want your glasses too? Okay. Mm -hmm. Like mother like daughter. <laughs> mm -hmm. She got her little glasses too much. We twinning. Hey girl. Hey girlfriend. I want you to match. You want me to match you? But we're matching twin. <laughs> hey, I'm not your twin. Bye, Nevia. Guys, so this is our little drive to daycare. It's normally a very peaceful morning, you know. I don't really have much traffic dealing with, and I love that. That was a good song, Mommy White. Yeah, it was when a really good song. When you drive a vehicle, so we're open, shut them, put them on your lap, lap, lap. It's a it's the Yes, the rabbit and the tortoise. Is it tortoise? Or fast turtle? Which one was it, baby? The turtle. Turtle? Yeah, because the rabbit is. Fast, fast, and the turtle is. Slow. 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 Good job. Loud and Loud and That That's my daughter, and this is. And I'm her grandma. You're a grandma? Yes, and my dad was acting so bad. Oh, it hurts. And when I always take my glasses off, stuff is too early. So that's the reason why I always keep my glasses on. <laughs> and I won't take it off! <laughs> this is my daughter's. Wear your glasses! <laughs> so I'm on my way to work now. Hope y'all enjoyed this little video of my what my morning to go do my 8 to 5. And then when I come home, I'm gonna do my 5 to 9. <laughs> I'm a living while I'm living to the father I will pray. 